finds Ba. Early ball, Flurio Chateau, a brilliant finish! To Diaz. In open space against the center back here, he runs right by Savage and takes off up the middle. Flurio Chateau trying to stay onside. He is onside, cuts it back to the left, buries it to the top corner! Nicola Flurio Chateau one more time put St. John's in front. Able to win that ball. Miguel Diaz holds up play a bit. Centers it. Kozak gives it up. Chateau shoots and scores. Two have connected on a goal. And he's on again. Florio Chateau racing in all over. Breakaway chance number two and he buries it. That one counts. Tibbert. Brand new game. One goal game with just under a half hour to go. And that's Gummison. A last ditch effort. And a really nice touch there by Flurio Chateau. That's, I don't think, out of the ordinary. Diaz plays in Cope. Cope, the right back, entered in, looks, picks out a ball, and in this time it's headed in. Flurio Chateau continues his magic this year. Injured and down off to his left. And I'm not sure if that's part of what Jim McKeldery was uh, concerned with with the referee. Oh, oh, Florio Chateau has scored again! Oh, he misspoke. It's Brady Guijo who's checked in for St. John's. Quick chance the other way! And the Johnny score! It's in white. Freshman from Bloomfield, New Jersey. Rutgers made headlines a little more than a week ago. We'll get there in a sec. St. John's tied! Just too heavy on the touch and taken away by Diaz. Long ball ahead, Florio Chateau working his way inside with a shot, and he scores. St. John's knocking on the door here, perhaps. Lamai lasers it off to his left. One more pass to that far side. Now the centering feed. Shot, it's in! By himself to take. Long heave in towards the box. Off of one head, now two heads, and it's in! And it's Florio Chateau again! Diaz winning that challenge the perseverance and now into the box Florio Chateau